hi everyone and welcome to my channel i hope you're all doing great if it's your first time of coming across my channel thank you so much for stopping by i really appreciate please do consider giving this video a thumbs up and subscribe and if you're a return subscriber thank you for always returning i really appreciate you um this video is basically about um the different reaction from different celebrities towards um the current chris land situation you know um this is be be being youtube i might not be able to um use some words because youtube might have to you know tackle me for that so but i'm gonna try as much as possible while telling you what's going on to you know say it in such a way you are definitely going to correlate uh so i'll be telling you there are there are different opinions what the different celebrities think about the viral videos the viral video they watched i couldn't get myself to watch this video and like till now i can't I, if someone was trying to send me the link i was like i can't i can't afford to watch it being that they are you know i said i can't watch it so i'll be sharing with you guys that there are, there are different opinions what they think about the video the measures that have been taken so far to ensure that such thing doesn't repeat itself and also the effort that tonto dk is putting towards uh ensuring that the video doesn't go beyond how far it has gone already it might also interest you to know that the Lagos state government didn't pay deaf ears to this situation, to the incident, and the school has also been suspended indefinitely while proper investigation is ongoing. Blessing CEO has also shared her own opinion concerning this very incident. Just in case you don't know her, she's a public figure, an influencer, and a marriage counselor. So in her Instagram handle, she shared, Advice to the parents of the little girl who is trending from their own story. I don't know who is advising you, but if it is a blogger, then you are doomed because it's just content for them. Let this case die. Your daughter was not, mm, please. If you continue to drag this case, you will mess with your daughter's confidence and mental health. All your daughter needs is therapy, not justice. Please stop the first alarm. Okay, so this is from Tonto DK, aka Tonto Late. Okay, so I just watched the Chris Lam video. All I can say is that is not mm. that ten-year-old girl knows. Mm. In my opinion, it's not her first, neither is it her fifth time. She has a much, she has a much older groomer somewhere. The family needs to ask the right questions and protect the girl more. Please stop sharing the video. The school is guilty for concealing the truth on such a horrible. Uh -huh. So Oluwani Shola, uh, Whiskey's baby mama, also spoke on it. She said, It took me a lot of thinking before dropping this comment. The way we just throw the world <coughs> around so loosely without considering how much damage it can cause. Firstly, as parents, we need to pay close attention to our kids and what we expose them to. Because, man, it's a crazy, crazy world we live in. Secondly, I accompanied my son to represent his school at the, at the just concluded WSG. And I can say for a fact that ten, the 10 year old in question was definitely not. <coughs> I remember vividly the shock in my son's face when he was telling me about a video some other kids was watching. He said, Mom, I couldn't stand the video. I had to excuse myself. He said the gist circulating was that the girl and her clique played a game of truth and dare, of which this particular girl couldn't stop with the mind bogging days. I couldn't believe my ears when I learned about the nasty activities these little kids get themselves. Uh, involved in to make matters worse even when she was accosted about the video she was owing it with her full chest saying yeah it's me in the video and so so she continued it bothered me so much i needed to see the kids in question so i would know how to advise my child against such kids well he knows better before they use their reggae spoil my blues god i beg but seeing this post now and the twist of it all, I just couldn't take it because I know for a fact, for a fact, that she's very sure how very, very strict the teachers were on this trip. Blaming such immorality and negligence on the school is unfair and it definitely wasn't a... <clears throat> Ma'am, they were in a hotel where other schools also stayed at. To avoid stories that touch like this, 
they made sure the boys room was on the 10th floor and the girls sec and the girls room second floor the teachers did their did their parade three to five times daily making sure they were all in their rooms there were over 70 kids to five to six teachers these teachers went through hell trying to get them together but for you to but for you to know how badly behaved these kids were they waited till after midnight after the last roll call to get their nasty acts on you can blame the guardians all you want for trying their best and breaking their backs for kids all you want okay all you want but charity begins at home hmm. in my own humble opinion no in my humble opinion like you know everyone is entitled to their own opinion i blame the school like even if the girl let me assume that all they are saying about her is true that she's probably spoiled already before they blah 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 but why would this happen under the nose of the teachers that the mom entrusted the children to, uh, uh, with seriously i blame them i'm sorry to say this though am i saying sorry but please eh, i want to i want to urge you if you know you watched that video if you had the nerves to watch the video please share your opinions in the comment section are these people right because to be honest with you i didn't watch the video normally i ought to have watched you know to know exactly what to say how to react uh, towards the child but being that they are you know kids i couldn't bring myself to watch it so please if you watched it please uh feel free to share your opinion in the comment section everyone is entitled to their own, own opinion don't be afraid just whatever you think if you think they are correct say okay yeah i watched the video after all i think they are right or something but if you blame the school just like i do even if the girl have spoiled before or whatever i blame the school because i can't pay so much Chris Land, do you know how much they pay as school fees? I can't pay so much to bring my child to your school. And according to the mother of the child, she didn't want the girl to go. She was being persuaded. Please let her go. Let her go. And she now paid hugely for her to travel to Dubai. And you came back with stories. The annoying part is this. It's not just that the girl was involved in an act. It's just because they hid it from this woman. What were their reasons for hiding it from the woman? And secondly, according to the woman, like I said, I, according to the woman, I wasn't there. They threatened this girl never to open up, never to speak up. You can imagine that. What are their reasons for doing that? How can, as in, they, they did so many things that that could make someone roll eyes, you know, that could okay you can imagine they went to the to, to their house to pick her up three consecutive times lying to her mom that she's going for a covid 19 test whereas they're taking for taking her for a pregnancy test three good times no no nah, it's unfair the mom came for the modern uh, mother's day meeting in their school and or whatever after she left they took her the the some of the school delegates took her to go and interrogate her they are, they are, no seriously the school did not try honestly speaking this school eh, honestly they, they they in fact we we, we we expected better from them after paying hugely how can you how can you take a child okay a, of 10 years old behind her parents without her pa parents uh, 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 consent to go and interrogate her what for for a whole month like one week two weeks three weeks four weeks you people hid this thing from this woman hmm I can only imagine the pain she's passing through honestly speaking because <laughs> let's understand that this is somebody's child this girl is precious to her parents no matter what no matter what the school ought to have taken good care of these children okay you can imagine five teachers to 70 students they were trying to save more not to, not, not minding uh, uh, if the five would be able to take care of the whole 70 children or the pupils rather it is well well this is my own opinion feel free to share yours in the comment section uh we are in a free world and please give this video a thumbs up if you are not subscribed to the channel what are you waiting for please go ahead and click on that red subscribe button down there click on the bell icon and select the option all so you'll be the first to see my video each time i upload i want to say a very big thank you to you for watching till this point and i sure would love to see you in my next video Bye bye